In this question, we have to solve the system of inequalities graphically. First, we will consider the first inequality. The line represented by the first inequality is 4x plus 4x plus 3y is equal to 60. When y is equal to 0, x is equal to 15. So the x x intercept is 15, 0. When x is equal to 0, y is equal to 20. So the y intercept is 0, 20. We draw a line between these two points and we get this line. This line we get. Now we will consider the second inequality. The line, line represented by the second inequality is y is equal to 2x. This is a line through the origin with the slope equal to 2. So we draw such a line through the origin with the slope 2 and we get this line y is equal to 2x. Now the third inequality is x greater than or equal to 3. This says that the feasible region lies to the right of the line x is equal to 3. This is the line x is equal to 3. Now the fourth and fifth inequality says that x y greater than or equal to 0. That means the feasible region lies in the first quadrant. Now we will consider a point. Four ten. And check in which part of the line this po this point four ten lies in the line four x plus three y is equal to sixty. Four x plus three y less than or equal to sixty. Four into four plus three into ten less than or equal to sixty. This gives forty six less than or equal to sixty. This is true. So the region lies in this direction from this line. 4x plus 3y is equal to 60. Now we will check the second inequality. y greater than or equal to 2x. That is 10 greater than or equal to 8. This is true. Hence, the feasible region lies in this direction from the line y is equal to 2x. Now we will consider the third inequality that is x greater than or equal to 3. Since 4 is greater than 
or equal to 3. The feasible region lies to the right of this line x is equal to 3 in this direction. The fourth and fifth inequality tells us that the feasible region lies in the first quadrant. The solid lines are because we have both equality and inequality here. We have both inequality and inequality here. Here also we have both inequality and inequality. Here also we have both equality and inequality. That is why the solid lines appear. So our feasible region is this region. The triangular region. This is the feasible region. That is our graphical solution to the question.